Ana Show here again, and today we're going to be doing an update video. But before we get started, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. So, today I wanted to do an update video with you guys. It's been three months since the first time that I purchased my J Scope Bell. Sorry, you guys, my daughter is in the next room and she's watching Pepper Pig and she's going crazy. So, you guys are going to be hearing her scream. It was the first time that I bought it, that was back in January. And so now we're in April and I definitely wanted to bring an update because I've been getting a lot, a lot of questions on this belt. I'm actually surprised on how much attention my um, first video got. If you did not watch that, please go ahead and watch it, especially if you plan on purchasing this belt. Because in that video, I'm going to go, I go more in depth than I will in this video. This is just simply an update video to let you know where I'm at. So the first time that I bought the belt... Um, I have bought a large and I have the belt actually right here with me. This is the bag that the one that I'm currently wearing um, came in. So this came in about, I think it came in on Easter, the day before Easter Sunday, it came in. And this is my other belt right here. So this is a large, as you guys can see, it looks a little used and stuff and we're gonna get into the usage and all of that um later on but this is it right here it looks kind of crazy and i don't know if you guys can see that but it says l right there for large when it came to sizing um i did not measure my waist size if i would have put my waist size in there it would have either gave me a medium or a small and i knew that those sizes were not going to fit me at the time at that time so i just went ahead and i went with the large and honestly it fit me very well i did get some comments under my last video and um i remember one comment said something along the line that i'm giving inaccurate information because i'm telling you guys not to enter your your uh that you that you should not size up pretty much honestly that was my experience and it works for me, so this is why I'm giving that advice. On top of that, I watched other videos, especially when I was doing my research before I bought this belt, and a lot of people were saying the same thing as me. Go ahead and size up because um, you may get a size. Let's say you you're not gonna go according to your um, size shirt. Like I wear a small, but I wouldn't buy a small. It would have never fit. Would have never sit up or anything like that. So I would definitely tell you size up i'm still gonna say that size up your first time that you're using this belt size up and then once you start to kind of um to slim down a little bit you can start to size down but don't get your exact size i would say if you know your precise sizes in your waist go ahead and go with that with with that measurement if that makes you feel more comfortable but I honestly sized up and I don't regret it. It worked out for me very fine. And I said in the first video, I loved the size that I got. It was comfortable. It was perfect for me. It was right there. Um, if I would have got a medium, it would have never, ever, ever fit. So since since the first time that I got the belt, um, I got it back in January. So I was going to the gym consistently and then February hit and I had so much things going on in my personal life. In February that I didn't make it to the gym till like mid or end of, of February to be honest with you so then after that I was consistent consistent consistently going to the gym I was always wearing my belt all the time I always made sure that I wear my belt um, even when I wasn't going to the gym I would wear my belt around the house for about like six hours and stuff just to kind of train my stomach I mean kind of train my waist um to also work on my back posture because that's something that i really wanted to work on and it's one of the reasons why i bought this belt because my back posture was trash so um i did that every single day when it came to dieting i do not diet you guys and the reason why i have to get into this is because i'm going to show you my progress pictures later so i've been getting so many questions about this I do not diet. I still eat the same way. The only thing is that um, I've always watched my portions and this has just always been me. Um, I don't really drink sugary drinks. I don't really drink soda or juice. Sometimes orange juice, like very rare, only with breakfast sometimes. But I'm more of a water and tea person and I, my alcohol consumption is not 
crazy either i don't really drink a lot i'm more of a social drinker um maybe i'll keep a bottle of wine in the house but i barely even drink that so um you know it's just a combination of working out um breaking out watching my portions um not taking a lot of in in intake of sugar or um even fried foods or anything like that i'm just not big on those things you know what i mean so um that kind of makes it a little bit easier but i have above anything else i have been exercising and the belt has been great it's never been uncomfortable um the belt actually stretches out after a while so like when you first get it if it's a little tight and stuff don't worry because it will um it will stretch out over time it is very comfortable it does not move it does not roll up um, when it comes to the sweat, it, the material absorbs the sweat, so you're not going to have sweat dripping or anything like that. So, so far, I love it. And guys, the progress that I've been seeing is amazing. I have not measured my waist at all, but um, I did take some pictures the other day, finally. I was like, let me take some pictures. Let me just, you know, see where I'm at and stuff because... On that particular day, I felt, you know, some days you feel kind of bloated and stuff like that. When that day, I felt slim, like I felt nice. So I was like, let me take a picture today. So to my surprise, when I seen the picture, I seen the major difference between that first time when I was filming my fitness videos, which the, the, the picture that you see that day, that was a couple of days before I received my J Scope belt. I was actually reviewing another fitness um, band. And so I had taken the screenshots from those pictures and I was amazed. I was like, oh my God, like I look a lot slimmer. My posture is a lot better. And I'm showing you guys on the side, just a couple of pictures so you can see, but I was very, very happy. Um, I would 100% recommend it. Where am I now? This is this is the big thing. So right now, I'm currently wearing a medium. I actually have my belt on right now. You guys can see this. Um, it's definitely a major difference. Also, not just that. Like, I see a major difference on my back. And, you know, just, just everything. My body just looks amazing. I feel amazing. I definitely feel super snatched i feel very comfortable i was really happy too because um i was really happy because when i ordered this belt i was worried that it wasn't gonna fit but at the same time i was like you know what if it doesn't fit i'll just put it in the closet and when it starts to fit i'll put it on because i was confident that it, the weight was gonna come off but at the same time when i ordered it i was confident enough that it was gonna fit so I was just ecstatic when I seen that it fit. The last thing that I want to touch on is shipping because this is probably the biggest controversy that um, that surrounds this company and the belt and all of that. So in my first video, I did mention that I got the belt within a week, right? So I placed my order it says here my order, I placed my order um, April 7th. So I got my, um, I got my belt within five days because I got it to 12. So I got it pretty fast. Again, this is the second time. This is my invoice right here. You can see, you can see the um, day that I ordered it. And then you can see how much the belt was. So... The belt cost $57.80. The first time I got it, it was $51 and change. Um, I used two different promo codes. Every month, there's a different promo code. Right now, there's one for April, so make sure you guys take advantage of it. I will be putting it down here. But um, this, so you do get a little small percentage off, and shipping is $10. So the shipping was pretty fast for me. I don't know if people are still having problems with the ship with the shipment being that that was the biggest controversy that i seen in a lot of videos but i did not have that problem again and i was happy about that as well um when you do when your order is processed it's passed on to this thing called arrive so you can download the app on your phone and you can track the order and stuff like that and i do like it 
But at the same time, the only thing that I don't like about Arrive is the fact that, you know, if you're getting a product like this where you're, like, super excited, um, it might mislead you for, like, one day. Like, one day it'll tell you, let's say, you're going to get it on Saturday, and then the next day it tells you you're going to get it on Sunday, and then it'll send you a notification saying, um, it'll keep it like that, and let's say Friday hits, it'll tell you that, your order will be delivered the next day. So it could be a little confusing and stuff, but I did not have any issues with my package, nothing. Again, I don't know if they're still giving the nutrition guides, but I, I didn't get the nutrition guide in mind. So that's that, you know. But anyways, let me know what you guys think. Like if you've gotten this belt before, let me know if you plan on getting this belt. Like I said, if you haven't checked out my my first review, which is a little bit more detailed on my order and stuff like that, go ahead and check that out. But I'm loving my belt, you guys. I am open to trying other waist trainers from other brands, but right now the J Sculpt one, it has my heart and it got my money too. So I will see you guys soon. Make sure you follow me on instagram at perata knows best also make sure you do check check out jscope on their instagram at jscope fitness i will see you guys soon bye